Welcome to Computational Science YouTube channel. In our today classes, we are going to see how to write a best report writing. So, how we can write reports in physics, in chemistry, in biology, actually in physics. So, for actually for the beginners, how we can write reports, actually for the fresh students, how to write a report. So to write best reports, be with us Computational Science YouTube channel and follow this uh, YouTube. So before going to see how to write a report, what does mean experiment? Let us define the experiment. So experiment is simply express this orderly procedure. This is orderly procedure this by verifying, refuting, or establish the validity of hypothesis. Identify the validity of hypothesis. Or it have, it have orderly procedure and it's to identify or the goal of verifying, refuting, and establishing validities. Experiment is provide to provide insight into the cause and effects, demonstrate what outcome occur when particle factor is manipulated. To insight the causes and of effects demonstrating to outcomes what outcome occurs. So experiment is also used to test existing theories. To test, we are using these experiments to test existing theory or new hypothesis in order to support them or disprove them. So when you are done experiments, what you are learning in classes, you can verify that. To verify what you are learning in theoretical parts, you can do the experiments. So also the experiment take place in laboratories. You could perform ex an experiment anywhere at any time. Experiment can be done in the laboratory or in out of the laboratory. It can be performed in any experiment in anywhere at any time, depending on your schedule. To look at the step of the scientific method, when somebody can be do experiments, must uh, follow the scientific methods. So the scientific method is as far as it can make observation. It make observation. It formulate hypothesis. It design and dis conduct experiments to test hypothesis. It evaluates the result of the experiments. It accept or reject hypothesis. If it's necessary, it make tests and the hypothesis. It must take the hypothesis. This is the scientific method of the uh, scientific method for the experiments. So another one is report laboratory reports writing guideline. What's guideline? How you can write reports? What is come first? What's the next one? So it is always necessary that the results obtained in an experiment must be reported clearly and ambitiously. So after you can uh, do the experiment, you can report the clear reports that come with the uh, readers make happy to your uh, report writing. So follow these steps. Style of report writing. What is we are write in the title page? What we are write in the title page? So the title page is contain the name of institute and the college. What is your college? You can write as center one in the uh, top as a center one. You can write the name of institute and the college. Then it's brief but informative title. You can write the very brief title. You can write your title in brief ways. Laboratory section, your laboratory section. Experiment what? The number of experiments also include experiment one, your title. Name of your group members present for that experiment. The name, of, the name of the students or your group members that can be presented in that lab work. You can write. Then the name of teaching assistant, instructor. It's the name of your instructor. You can write. Then at the end, you can write the date that experiment is performed. The date that the experiment was performed. You can write in this way. This is the title page. This is the title page. The main body of the experiment can be bigger in the objective. So, so this is 
the sample of the cover page. For example, under here, it can say that Mats University, Faculty of Natural and Compositional Science, Physics Department. This is the name of an institute and the name of college. This is experiment physics, experimental physics one. Physics, this is the code of that experiment. Experiment one, then you can write the, your title, title of the experiment. Name of the group, you can write here, your ID number. Laboratory instructor name, you can write here. Date actual experiment done, you can write here the date that experiment was performed. This is a sample of per bit. The main body of the experiment is starting from the objective of the experiment. The objective, the first page, the first page, in the first page, in the main body, you can write the objective. The objective contains general statements that will describe what you wanted to outcome with at the end of that experiment. What is your outcome at that end of that experiment is written under the objective. The objective should state the problem that your procedure and data attempt to answer. It should state the problem. Some key verbs that you are using in the objective may include to investigate, to plot, to measure, or to compare. This is some verbs that you are using when you are writing the uh, objective. Uh, this is the ways of writing the objective. The second one is theory. In the main body, the second one is theory. Theory means it's a concise description of the relevant theory should be provided when the theory is needed to understand other parts of the reports, such as data analysis and discussion, to give more information, to understand more about your title, you can add some related works or the, some related information uh, under this theory. To give necessary theoretical backgrounds, you can add some theories under this. Then the third one is apparatus, materials, Chemicals can be written here. The apparatus that you are used in to do that experiment. The apparatus or the material or the chemical that you are used to perform that experiment. So you are list the name of the apparatus, the name of the chemicals. So all can be listed under the apparatus. The another one is the procedure and the techniques. The procedure. What procedure you can use to do that experiment? What you can do first? What is the second steps? What is the third steps? All steps can be written under this procedure. As you know that is in the your manual, the step is written in the blood forms or in the number one, in the number ways. But when you are writing the reports, when you can report but you can write in the paragraph forms. You can write the verbs that you are using in the report form is the past tenses. In your manual, it must it can be it is uh, written in the future or in the present ways. But in when you are writing a report, you can change that verbs in what in past tense forms. You can write in past tense forms. Detailed procedure you need to carry out with this experiment. Step by step, what's the first second? Sufficient information should be provided to allow to the reader to repeat the experiment in an identical manner. So it must have a sufficient information. The procedure describes that what was done in the lab and should therefore it be written in the past tenses. Another what you are reminding is copying the procedure from the lab manual would be an inaccurate reflection of the work completed in the lab and it is not acceptable copying from this direct from the manual is not recommended when you are writing your reports you can write in the paragraph forms then you can change that verb in the past tense forms another one is the data what is the raw data from what from that observation or from your procedure what you can take what is your raw data all the Pretend raw data obtained during the experiment as presented in the session under the data. This is only the raw data, the information that you are collected from your procedure. This type of data will vary according to individual experiments. It must observation or it must image. It must or the data that you are sketching just like a table. So all numerical data should be tabulated carefully. You can take all data carefully. Analysis of the data, the 
the another step is analysis of the data after you can record the data that data must be analyzed this session describes textual form how to can formulate manipulation of the data carried out to give equation and the procedure used this using the equation and the pro what you are collected you can draw the graph you can list what is the error you can uh, find the slope all can be done under this uh, this final result of data analysis report in this session using figure using graph using table or other other convenient forms uh, Another one is discussion. After you can, unless it's the data, you can discuss. To try make a sense is your data indicates where the systematic error may have affected your results. What the error is occurred, how you can resolve that error. What you can make a sense is your data. Your data makes sense, give us a sense. The reader make a sense. The person that, that can be read your report is, must be very happy in your data if your discussion is very fine. So you can write, give your uh, essence your data under this discussion. You should describe, you should describe, you, you should analyze, you can explain all your results here. This session should answer the question, what do the data tell me? What is that data, your collect data, what you can show you? So you can describe it. The logical projection from the outcome, for instance, need repeat the experiment or measure the certain variable differently. Then after this, you can write a conclusion in one paragraph, based paragraph. Based on the conclusion or your results, explain the meaning of the experiment, implementation of results, examine the outcome in the light of the standard. This should answer the question, so what? So what is outcome? What you get from that? So what? You are answer for the question, so what? seek to make conclusion in broader content in the light of the result this section may be very short but it make it informative it's very short actually in one paragraph then as the end you can insert the references what references you can use this to get more information under the theories all it can be done under this so you can using these voices, the references. This is all how to can writing reports. So you can using the citation, base citation expression. You can using that. Uh, this is the ways of writing a reports actually in physics, biology, and the chemistry. So uh, using this uh, format, you can do your experiment. Best writer uh, re writing reports can be done, and just like this. In another classes, we are coming into another experiment in physics and in physics and the chemistry so you can like share and subscribe our youtube channel thank you with the time with us